what? We have our friend Patrick Evans Hilton in the kitchen. And the kitchen is getting hot, hot, hot. Yes. How are you? I'm fabuloso. And you? I love it. Fabuloso. <laughs> That's my favorite word. Well, thank you for coming back again. So, Patrick. Yes. Kids are out of school. Oh, my goodness. And you know what does that mean? It means we need to start drinking, right? No. Oh. Before we drink, we well, need... Well, no, we, you need a mommy. You need a timeout <laughs> teeny. But before, oh. before, we need to prepare snacks. All right. More snacks uh, and more snacks because I guess the kids so. are in the but house. But how about teaching them how to do it so you can have... A, mommy needs okay. a timeout teeny. You win on that one. All I right. like that one. Let's <laughs> teach our parents. <laughs> I taught preschool. I know the score. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. Okay, so what we can do in the house and how we can help our kids to prepare their own food Absolutely. so they can eat healthy. Absolutely. So I've come up with a fun little pizza, and it makes uh, uh, the base is a tortilla shell. Uh -huh. And fill this here. You know, you would never know that that was just a regular flour tortilla. Yeah. But it's been crisped up in a microwave oven, and it's so easy. And kids can do this because they just put it a uh, tortilla on a plate, mm -hmm. put it in the microwave for 30 seconds. Okay. Flip it, put it on the microwave for 30 more seconds, and then turn it over and flip it again in 30 more seconds, and it crisp up just like just like that. Just like this just one. Like, woo. Oh my God! So you just get like that. that crunchy yes. crisp. Just in the microwave? Yes, just in the microwave. And so they're not having to use an oven. They're mm -hmm. not having to cut anything. And then you just put on, I'll go ahead and pull yes. this over here for you. And then take a look at that. Nice. So you just put on some tomato sauce, tomato mm -hmm. paste. They just open a jar and put it on. Again, no cutting or anything. Some mozzarella cheese that's already pre-grated. And then a couple of pepperonis, or you could put on some uh, anything you want, some vegetables, some mushrooms. And then they heat it for just 30 seconds more. Another 30 so seconds So two more? minutes and it's all done. I love it because actually they can come up with ideas like you just yes. mentioned it and put more vegetables and play with the colors, green peppers, red peppers, corn. You can customize yes. your own pizza at home with a tortilla. And it's so, How smart it's is just that? so <laughs> easy to do. And again, it's very kid friendly. And I while know. they're eating the pizza. Mommy is ready for the drink. I know. <laughs> I know. That's the best part. But now, how we can teach them also to eat healthy while they're preparing? Well, you know, I, sure. I think I think yeah. using vegetables okay. when you can, mushrooms. This is actually turkey pepperoni instead okay. of the full fat pepperoni. Um, if you want to crumple up some sausage, maybe it's vegan sausage. Mm -hmm. You know. Um, so there's lots of lots of different ways, you know, to do that. The emphasis mm -hmm. on vegetables and portion control. I love it, and it sounds so easy to prepare at home with our kids. Now, I know you. we need a break after the kids are going to be, Mommy, snacks, 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 <laughs> right? Now we teach them. They can do their own. So, And again, we talk, it's all about vegetables <laughs> because vodka is potato-based, and it's about portion control, <laughs> and we're going to have one martini glass full. So, it. you know. So what is the name that you create for the tortilla pizza? Oh, for the tortilla, it's a pizza, pizza or I'm sorry, a tortizza. So tortiza. a little bit tortilla, a little bit, a little bit tortilla. So it's tortilla. Yes. I love it. See. Si. See. Si. <laughs> okay, now it's our time for the parents yes. to yes. relax while they're eating the pizza. Yes. So yes. what do you have for us? So we have um, some vodka from mm -hmm. our friends at Reverend Spirits there in Norfolk. My good friend Carl Dorneman is the uh, distiller. Love these brands. And so we've already put in okay. a sh cocktail shaker with some ice and okay. some vodka. And then you guess the secret ingredient mm. is peach schnapps. Oh my God, it yes. smells so good. Yes. Yes. Peach. Forget everything you remember about schnapps before you were a mommy and you were in college. All of those bad memories, they're gonna be just, <laughs> just fine, just fine. It's okay, we are home, it's vacation, it's summer. And this is cranberry it. juice. Cranberry now, I like juice. to use real cranberry juice and okay. not the fruit cocktail version of it, mm -hmm. but you could do either. You wanna pour that in yes, for me? Yes, sure. I like the color, actually. It does. It so we have water. Oh, no, vodka. Oh, vodka. Vodka. Oh, okay, yes, you mentioned it before. Oh, look at this. Yes. So yummy. Mmm, love it. And now so we're now, gonna put the This is lid a Quincy's favorite part. Yes. So, you know, it's times like this, and of course <laughs> I'm dating myself, but you gotta wonder, you know, WWKCD, <laughs> what would Casey and the Sunshine Band do? And they would shake, shake, shake. Shake, shake, shake. Shake, shake, shake. shake your <laughs> cocktail. Okay, I love it. Shake I love it. Shake your so. cocktail. Yes. That's right. I'm not like that smart like you, <laughs> but yes. Well, this is actually. Pretty, pretty cool uh, for the summer, for just enjoying in the house with, even with your friends, when you bring the kids over, they can prepare the pizza, we can do this. So Patrick, tell me, tell me a little bit more about 
How have you been doing this summer? Any oh. events coming up? Oh, I've been I've been doing doing absolutely fabulous, <laughs> preparing for the summer. But I was going to share one more little secret, just like yes. the, just like the Ginsu knife commercial says. But wait, there's more. We're going to top <gasps> this off with champagne. Champagne, that's my favorite word. <laughs> and it's going Lots. to be garnished there with a orange wedge. Ooh, so yes, lovely. yes, so isn't that beautiful? Take, it is so beautiful. Again, it super tiny, easy. tiny little sips, mm -hmm. tiny, tiny little bites. Happy household. I know. During the summer. I know. Thank you, Patrick. Yes. So for more recipes like these, easy and convenient to do at home, how can people find you? It's um, VirginiaEatsAndDrinks.com, and we're also going to have information. There's a great time. Uh, our, our con I'm sorry. There's a, <laughs> I haven't had a drink yet. There is a <laughs> great event in Colonial you. Williamsburg coming up <laughs> that I'm going to have information about, too, that you'll want to be sure and check out. I love that. So while we are enjoying our drink with Patrick, we have to go to commercial break coming up. Next is game time on Living 757. Don't go anywhere. Cheers. Cheers.